Getting to Know Your Laptop Part 2, Windows 11. Hello and welcome to Conestoga. In this second video about getting to know your new laptop, we will conduct a short tour and an introduction to Windows 11. Windows 11 is what is known as an operating system. Your computer's operating system is a powerful software that controls and coordinates a computer's hardware devices and runs other software and applications. This is how you will interact with software, install and manage apps, customize settings, and manage hardware as you get more comfortable with your laptop. The Desktop After logging onto your device, you are taken to the desktop. You can see your software, taskbar, start menu, and more here. You can add files here that you want to access regularly, and shortcuts to different apps or web pages that you might want quick access to. Start menu. Click on the window icon to launch the start menu. You will find all of your apps here. You can pin some that you use frequently. Click all apps to see an alphabetical list. You can also access your device settings from this menu. Settings. You can complete various tasks to customize and protect your computer in the settings menu. Access your privacy and security, accessibility settings, and updates here. You can customize the look and feel of your device under Personalize. You can also set your time zone and language and connect to Wi Fi or Bluetooth devices here. File Explorer. You can use File Explorer to locate and manage your files. You can pin files for quick access. Create new folders to help organize your files. You can also find files you downloaded from the internet here in the Downloads folder. Locate files in two ways. Use the search box at the top right corner of the File Explorer and specify which folder or drive to search in. You can search by file type, keyword, and name. You can use the search box on the taskbar to search for files as well as programs and other items. For more information on file management, visit the Digital Skills Toolkit for some excellent tips and tricks. Installing and removing software. Different software has different installation instructions. Follow the prompts in the software's installation process to download and install it on your device. Always read the system requirements for the software you want to install before installing it. Removing or uninstalling software is easy. Go to Settings and then click on Apps. Locate the app you want to remove. Click on the More Actions button and select Uninstall. Follow the prompts to completely remove the app. For more information on software downloads available to students at little or no cost, visit the Conestoga ITS Downloads page. Connecting to Wi-Fi. Click on the Wi-Fi icon in the bottom right corner of the taskbar. Click on the arrow to the right of the Wi-Fi icon in the pop-up menu. Select the network you would like to connect to, and if required, enter the security credentials. For more information on connecting to Wi-Fi on campus, visit the Conestoga ITS website. Internet browsing. Windows 11 comes with the Microsoft Edge browser installed. If you want to install another browser, such as Chrome or Firefox, navigate to the appropriate page and complete the download and installation process. As a college student, there are many services and portals that you may want to keep track of. Consider bookmarking your most frequented sites. That way, you can easily navigate to them quickly. To bookmark a site, here we are using Microsoft Edge, 
navigate to the site you want to bookmark. In the address bar, click the star beside the URL. You can bookmark it to the default favorites folder or manage your bookmarks by adding new folders. To see all of your favorites, click on the star icon to the right of the address bar. One other browser tip is using the More Actions button. Here in Microsoft Edge, the three dots button is located in the top right corner of the browser window. From here, you can access your browser history, downloaded files, set up privacy settings, and change your preferences to customize how your browser works best for you. Please note that other browsers have the same functionality as we discussed, but the steps to access the functions will differ slightly. Take some time to try different browsers to familiarize yourself with the similarities and differences. In this video, we explored some of the important functions in Windows 11. There is much more to know about Windows, so if you have any questions, please reach out to the ITS department or the Teach Me Tech team at the library.